We are faithful to our faith. We, are faith. we, lo we love our, our faith very a lot. And uh, uh, as you might know, that we left our country because we don't want, we didn't want to deny our faith. An estimated 5,000 pilgrims, mostly Christian refugees from Iraq, flocked to the Basilica and National Shrine of Our Lady of Consolation in Cary, Ohio, to celebrate the Assumption of Mary. Of course, she helped. She helped us. Always, she helped us. Thanks to the Virgin Mary. The Chaldean Catholic Church is an ancient rite that is based in Iraq. Over 100,000 Christians have fled from persecution in that country, and a large number have been resettled as refugees in the Detroit area. Chaldean people have suffered from back home. They have no power over them. They have nobody to protect them. That's why they flee out of their native country. God and Virgin Mary saved them to come over here and live peaceful. I am a physician. Yeah, many, many things I faced there, terrorists. They came to our building to kill us. And uh, American soldiers saved us. Iraqi Christians began to make the annual pilgrimage from Detroit to Ohio about two decades ago, patterning their devotion after similar celebrations in their homeland. Many camp at the shrine for nine days, visiting with family and attending the frequent celebrations of sacraments. We have a lot of uh, feasts, we call them shera. So we go also like, uh, you see a lot of people camping, music, dancing, food, and uh, we, we end it with, with, the, with the mass and procession. So it's similar, so that's why, you know, when I'm here, I feel like home, <laughs> you know. The whole family would come in and uh, camp here for like three days, spend, you know, and just, uh, you know, wonderful things to do. And it's been passed from one tradition to another. The shrine has been a pilgrimage site since 1875 and is linked to many miraculous occurrences and healings. I know it breathes a lot of new life into me, and I think the friars that come here love to do this because the people are so hungry for anything that is faith-based and so hungry for their, to practice their Catholic faith. Like you see all the people around here coming with their problems, with their, with their concerns, to just show it to our Mother Mary and just like trust in her and in her son. To me, that is the, the happiest moment I have ever, and I'm grateful that, you know, that God has called me to this life, just to, to be a witness also to, to these people here.